Hi, I'm Penny from Smart Financial. Let's learn about the differences between open peril and named peril coverage in homeowners insurance. An open peril home insurance policy covers any peril that damages your home as long as the policy doesn't specifically list that peril as an exclusion. This differs from named peril coverage, which only insures your home and belongings against perils like fire and theft that are listed in the policy. For example, if a heat wave caused your wooden outdoor furniture to suddenly crack, an open peril policy would pay to repair the furniture as long as it doesn't list heat waves as an exclusion. However, a named peril policy wouldn't cover this damage if heat waves aren't among the perils insured by named peril policies. Though it is sometimes known as all risk coverage, open peril insurance won't actually cover every possible source of damage to your home. These policies commonly exclude coverage for wear and tear, floods, earthquakes, home-based businesses, and more. The most common type of homeowner's policy provides dwelling coverage on an open peril basis and personal property coverage on a named peril basis. However, you may want open peril coverage across the board if your region frequently experiences perils a named peril policy won't cover, or if you simply want the extra peace of mind that comes with more comprehensive coverage. Smart Financial can help you find the best open peril policy for your home. Click the link in the description box below for a free homeowner's insurance quote.